Yo, what up, peeps? Terror talks right back at you. Last time we left off, we kind of passed the bridge, and now I'm gonna toss up my dowsing machine so I can, you know, go through and catch pokies. But first and foremost, well, not catch pokies, but you know what? Uh, we're gonna put Dilly 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 on the front. Dilly 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 ja. Yeah, don't. Yeah, I'm not giving it a second again. All right, fight me. <laughs> what do you have? Do you know, Pastor? You must get through me. So in this episode, we're gonna sit here and. Fight all of these random trainers. This guy looks just like Chuck. Oh, I'm glad I got Dylan up front. Look at that. Perfect matchup. Level 36. Level. I gotta stop. Let's see. The reason why I went and trained up was because I saw a comment where somebody said, um, "Guess this is going to give you trouble." So I was like, "Okay, so I'm just gonna like you know just go train up, you know, I guess this. Now I'm like. I'm kind of overpowered, but it's probably going to come in handy later, so... Not really tripping. Aerial Ace, this thing, this thing's going to die, just because it's it's first form. It's not evolved. Boom, shock, lock, you're dead. But bye, Scraggy. I love you. But not anymore, because I have a Scrafty. What? Dick move. Alright, what do you have to say for yourself? If, you, if what? You want me to give you my Pokemon? And if you lose, what do I do? What do I get? Do I get your Pokemon? Crocorock. Crocorock. <laughs> a Crocorock. All right, we're gonna smack this guy with a surf because that's what we do with these things. Um, question of the video: Who do you think is the coolest looking Pokemon? Yeah, answer it. Yep. Mm -hmm. I'm not even gonna answer this the question because uh, I don't think I could. I'm gonna just leave, leave this thing in. I'm gonna hit fly. I'm gonna surf this thing. Let's just wash this freaking. Wash this garbage away. Let's do it. Get the heck out of here, Charles. Oh, wow. You're not dead. Don't, don't poison. Don't poison. Don't poison. Thank you very much. This might win an aerial ace just because it's super quick, fast, and in a hurry. Like, man. And you're dead. Freaking Garbador. Garbador, Garbador. Alright, yeah, yeah, you should give me your Pokemon since you told me all that shoes. And I know those guys are a double battle. I know they're a double battle. <laughs> so, in that respect, we're gonna go like this. The two level, the two that needs to, like, I don't wanna level up. Hey, hey, what do we have here, boys? Hmm, you have a good Pokemon, let's see. Hey, hey, a bad one teamed up with another bad one. Do you know what that means? It means we're very bad. Yeah, very bad at freaking fighting. That just looks so wrong. <laughs> oh, look at that, double scrags. Oh, look at that. And we have double super effective. I wonder who's going to win. Hmm, Aerial Ace. Psychic, and you're dead. And wait for it. Get the get the experience. And oh wait, I forgot. It's freaking. Oh, that's right. It's dark. I don't have like miracle eyes. Jeez. What else? If I had miracle eye, I think we'd be, like super dead. Well, then I would have to like use the second, you know. But anyway, I think we'd be super dead. Doesn't matter. I forgot typings. Oh, level 50, baby. What I'm talking about. So we got a level 50 awesome salt. I got two level 50 Pokemon right now. I'm so happy about that. So I'm not really sure if like that's probably not gonna like be super like effective just yet, but I see I'm gonna wait and use him. So I'm gonna toss. I'm gonna put you in front. Nah, because if I put you in front then. All types of things and blah blah blah. So we're gonna give you an exp blah, blah. experience share if I can speak properly, which I can never seem to do. And I forgot you got the amulet coin. Like, I don't even put you in battle. So it's like, why do I even still have that thing on him? No one can beat your speed and fear. All right, fine. Uh, that's what you say. I mean, I'm just gonna. I guess upon it's hard. And that thing part steel. Is that fighting steel? I don't know, I'm gonna scald it, just to see what the hell happens. Bam! They should introduce, like, a mixture of attacks. If they, like, they should have, like, one... See like how this one, like, is water and it burns, or has a possibility of burn? They should have it, like, fire slash water. 
No be chill. I found a lemonade. Was this the shopping mall? I'm gonna go in there in a, in a second. Fight me. <laughs> you will force me to join your team. Okay. Are you guys gonna be the new syndicate in like the next gen Pokemon? Like six gen Pokemon? You guys gonna be like Team Roughneck? <laughs> Hashtag Team Roughneck for uh, 2013 Pokemon all day. I wonder what they even release one next year. They probably would like come out like 2014. They'll probably start. They'll probably start if they keep it going. They'll probably start like the end of it. I wouldn't want to really see a sixth gen. I want to see like a good, like a good Pokemon game. You know, not necessarily one that continues. All right, so first Pokemon we can catch on this route, guys, is dun 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 a Gothitelle, Gothrita. And since you guys know my Nuzlocke rules, my Nuzlocke rules are. I'm gonna, I'm gonna just surf this thing. They are if I happen to find a Pokemon of which that I already own on the first encounter, I can go ahead and catch the second one. That is not one that I already have. So, next Pokemon, which is the first one that we can catch. I'm just gonna take this little root over here. Double grass. Oh, this that super crazy, like ridiculous level 100 cave down here, right? I think, I don't know. First Pokemon we can catch, it is a Mencino. So I'm gonna like attempt to catch that. Um, I'm gonna smack this thing with a uh, an aerial ace. It's probably gonna kill it because I'm too overpowered and the thing's dead. Oh well. Oh, it's not dead. Oh my god. What a what a beast. She was like, I want to be on your team. So we got an aerial. We, we're gonna catch this day. I'm gonna toss a great ball at it just because. Things not that great, you know. So, um, yeah. <laughs> oh wow, really? That's how you feel? That's how you find? Fine, I'll just use an Ultra Ball. I got 16 of them. You don't get caught. What am I going to name this? I'm probably going to end up naming this. Um, I don't know. Wow. Wow. This thing is annoying. If you don't stay in this ball this turn, I'm gonna actually just take you out. I just have to throw a timer ball at you. And if that doesn't work, then I'm just gonna just destroy you. Give me another one. Get, get, and get better. That's what I thought. Um. The Chinchilla. I don't wanna call this thing Chiotomy. I just like the original names, like. There's nothing against naming it, or it's original, like it's Japanese name, so. I would name it like after like, cause I have a few, I have it like written down of people that want me to name something after them. Um, but uh, it's a female. So I'm not sure exactly how people would be like, oh, I'm, but that's a female, blah, blah, blah. blah. So yeah, uh, that's why I didn't really do that. Gotcha! It's Max Ether. Yeah. Alright, so I can keep like. Alright, I noticed something over here. Damn it! Look, it's another Missino! Yay! Do these things ever come male? They have to. There's like male jinxes and things. These have to be freaking. Oh my god, first step away from the encounter. Oh, this douche knob. I'm glad I didn't catch you. I don't like you. I don't even want to, I don't even want to, want to fight you. I'm out of here. Get out of my face. Alright, please. Don't make me throw that on the bell. Over store. Go see what this guy has to say. I think this, isn't this like one of those caves where like the legendaries are in? Where one of them is? Only strong Pokemon live in this cave. The champion of the and goes up for training, but you aren't ready for this challenge. Alright, fine. Peace out. I'm going to just toss the repel down. Just because I don't really want to encounter anything right now. Those things are annoying, just encountering stuff. I have a lot to spare. So, uh, why the hell not? And I can't go through that tree. Damn it. Damn my lack of intangibility. I want to go to the shopping mall real quick. Let's see what they have here. So this is the department center, right? This is the department store of 
the old days, pretty much. Hello, Webby. What do you sell? What are you selling? Pokey toy. Okay, interesting. Not really. All right, so that's the basic items. What's up? You have TMs, TMs, TMs. What are you selling? Giga Impact and Hyper Beam. Yeah, no, thank you. I don't really care for turns that force you to rest. That's those are not really great. What are you selling? We got all the balls. Oh, we got quick balls. Up the yin yang. Give me like ten of them. Well, it's, wow, no, not seventy six. Calm down. <laughs> Calm down. All right, I'm just gonna buy nine. It's because I. Yeah. And I was wondering if I could catch the, if I could buy these. Thankfully, I can. To talk to people, blah, blah, blah. so I can uh, actually come on, hurry up and get your eyes back. Oh, God dang it. Why are you running behind the stairs? Like, that's how kids are so stupid. Jeez, so I'm just gonna run behind the stairs. All right, so what do we have? Um, I would love to buy some of these. Like, I can only buy six. I'm gonna buy two carbos. Screw that, I don't even care. Like, I never bought them, so you're probably the guy that has like the X attack, the X the battle items, right? Get the hell out of here. Get out of my face. Yes. <laughs> wow, that gives me two Thunderstones. I have like a, I have a Thunderstone, a Firestone. Oh, you want to fight? I have Thunderstone, Firestone, Leafstone, Sunstone, Shiny Stone. So many stones, man. I got so many stones. Level 36. Mencino. This thing just, he just caught this thing. <laughs> like, he legit just caught this thing outside. I think the one I caught was like level 36. Wow. Get O code. Lampant. Don't know what you are. Oh, it's that lamp thing. Obviously. It's just like, wait, it's a lamp. <laughs> it's a freaking lamp like what how can you not know that I was like wait mm -mm -mm. Hey, peace out Chuck get out my face so he has the chinchilla because he cleans and he has the lamp because he uses the I don't want to know he needs to see so she wants to battle me as well I'm glad I'm getting all this experience also I went and battled those guys and uh, people in the on the field or the baseball fields and stuff and uh not not grenade nimbasa in nimbasa city so i'm gonna smack this thing with a surf hopefully it doesn't like you know smack me up with something ridiculous with like an oko or something i'll be upset uh uh retaliate i hate these things that retaliate it's like stop it <laughs> It's like if you don't oko that if you see one of these things in battle and you just killed its teammate and you don't oko that thing, you're in trouble. You're in match. Oh, that's only if you're doing Nuzlocke. You're in trouble. I'm not really gonna buy any like of those lemonades because I still have some. And these are like the super awesome mangs, mecha stairs. We got like mad battlers up in here. Like, yo, people just want to battle. I like that. I mean, because that's what I need. I need that experience. But probably not on these Pokemon that I have out front. I just want to get Dylan up to level 50. That's my goal to get everybody to at least level 50. Um, then level them up like maybe during the gym battle, you know, just maybe get them like a couple levels. And um, yeah, because like I said, I still have those two rare candies. Lilligant. I still have those two rare candies that I can like toss on anybody at any point in time if needed. So. Yeah, but that's only gonna be two levels. But most likely, if I do need to use them, it's probably gonna end up being on Scrafty, of course. Because in the um, what's your face, go through, go through tell. Yeah, waitress flow. Just get back to saying that insurance. All right, um, so we're gonna swap out. Give me this lucky egg. Thank you very much. Then we're gonna go into. Regina really needs it. Like, Regina really needs battling. So, like, really, really, like, really bad. Like, like, really, really bad. <laughs> like, like, geez. Like, she's probably gonna be like the 
the neglected one. What's this? A PP up. Oh, I got my PP up. Ba -ba -ba. I don't know what the hell you, what the hell you talking about. Alright, um. There's not another room. Anybody else want to battle? No one else wants to battle. Oh, you guys suck. Yeah, I pretty much did talk to everybody in here. Well, alright then. I'm getting the hell out of here. Bye bye now. So we're gonna piece the heck out this way because uh, this is the city. You. Munch munch, I heard the guy. Blah, 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 munch munch. Okay, so. Cool beans. I'm gonna swap out and put, um. Nah, yeah, whatever. We're good. What's up, dude? Hello, William. This way. Oh, God. Another one of these town hall meetings. What a liar. Desperately trying to get. Just really trying to con everyone with his speech. That's correct. Our Lord N has combined his power with the legendary dragon type Pokemon and intends to create a new world. We herald the return of the hero of Unova, the founder of this hero. Hero, dragon, legend? Pokemon are different from people. They are living beings who contain unknown potential, and I'm still long winded with my speeches. They are living beings from whom we humans have much to learn. They are beings whose greatness we should acknowledge. Beings who should be freed from our oppression. Freed Pokemon? We, Team Plasma, invite you to join us. We want, we all want to create a new world from what Pokemon and people are both free. Ladies and gentlemen, I ask you now, please release your Pokemon. And so I may end, so I end my plea to you today. Thank you. Wow. Thank you one and for all for your attention. Thank you for listening. This has been Getz with his uh, public service announcement. As I peace the hell out. Bye-bye. And he's out of there. Is it true? Have we been making Pokemon suffer? Hmm. Maybe we should do release a Pokemon like Team Plasma says. No way. Without Pokemon, I'll be lonely and sad. And they disperse. What was that about? That speech was off the charts strange. The cooperation of Pokemon, uh, the cooperation of people in Pokemon is how Unova came to exist to begin with. If a Pokemon really didn't want anything to do with humans, it would simply leave capturing a poke. Well, whatever. Yeah, it would simply leave. I misread that because I didn't see the period because I hit A too quick. Anyway, capturing a Pokemon in a Pokemon doesn't mean you've captured its heart. Agreed. Let's go, William. It's been a while, Iris and Drayden. Oh, oh Mr. Alder and the guy who helped out that time. What's wrong? What does the wandering champion who left the Pokemon League need from us? Briefly, my request is this. Does the legend about the Dragon Ball Pokemon blah blah blah? Are you talking about Zekadom or Restaurant? What is the sudden interest? Moments ago, a troublemaker known as Getsis was here. He said a trainer named N has reawakened Zekrom. Yes. The ch that trainer called N apparently told William here to search for the other Dragon type Pokemon. Let me check that I have this straight. This N or what have you presumes to set the two Dragon type Pokemon against each other in battle to test his convictions. No! The dragon type Pokemon got along so well. Well get along so well. That's right, Iris. The ones who make Pokemon battle are the trainers. And so it's so the trainers and Pokemon can get to know each other better. I'm going into the Pokemon League. No, I guess in this case I should say I'm returning to the Pokemon League. Of course I'll defeat N. I'll teach him about the beauty that this world of this world where Pokemon trainers live together in harmony. Also, William, I'll await your arrival. Once you've attained the Opelucid battle. Gym badge, whatever, blah blah blah. Come to the league. Don't be living with the gym badge, blah blah blah. Take care of Fire Alcott. No, you drain the iris. And he pieces the hell out. Why didn't he just fly? Oh, he's gone. Is he okay? He looked kind of scary. Don't worry, Iris. He is the strongest trainer in all of Unibus. No, second strongest. Dang it, get it right. Well, well, William, is it? Come to my home. As Alder asks, I'll tell you everything I can about the legendary dragon type Pokemon. Iris, child, please show the way. You bet. If it is, if it's Opulent City, I can take you anywhere. As for the story of Zekrom and Restroom, well, we'll tell you all we know about it this way. 
that way. Okay. This dude is like rocking out with his guitar. What do you say? What do you got to say? Lucid, taste, pleasure, pleasure, blah, blah, blah. I imagine, blah, blah, blah. I don't care. And we're gonna heal up because uh, that's what we do. And uh, that's kind of a new big deal, you know what I'm saying? Her, 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 her. And it is about time that I go ahead and end this part off. Next time, guys, we come back, we will be actually exploring the town, then going to Drayden's house, and then probably battling him in that same video. But I don't know. Channel Talk signing out with this episode of Pokemon Black Nose. Like, tell us to catch you guys next video. Peace out.